We visited Scotland's biggest poundland. Why? Because you guys. I've taken them out. She started to put her items back in and still didn't notice I'd removed the ones she just put in two minutes ago. It's behind you. It actually had some pretty banging music on, so I've danced my whole way around here with Hudson and even uh, got a little bit raunchy with the Easter bonnet on. Loads of home items, but loads of empty shelves as well because this bit's been heaving for the last few weeks. Hudson's obsessed with pulling hair, so maybe Barbie could help us out. Look at these pop things. Three pounds each. I'm sure that's a proper bargain. Are they not way more expensive than that? There's a massive toy section. Again, it ranges from one pounds to five pounds. And a massive stationery section. Even had Paw Patrol bags, which seems to be Hudson's favourite just now. If you're a keen wee knitter or even just want to grab a birthday card, or perhaps you want to get your food shopping. It has got a massive frozen food aisle and fridge aisle, which I haven't seen in any Poundland before. These look fine, yeah, by the way. So there is a big wide range, and I do think some of it's cheaper, but not all of it is. But then I found this carpet care, and I thought, my wife could do a wee bit of that. She wasn't the best pleased though. I don't know why. I'll keep looking. That's what she needs. Then I found some elbow grease, you know, to speed up the action a little bit. And again, look at the face. She was so annoyed Back at in me. The day, you got in and put that in a roll. Yeah. Well, to sum it up, I would pretty much say that this big poundland has everything a supermarket has and a wee bit more. Yeah, I can have a huge price saver. Yeah. Could we get a picture with you to yeah. put on our internal? Like a Facebook yeah, yeah, we'll we'll Well, thanks to those who recommended Poundland for us. I hope you enjoyed this vlog and let me know where you want us to check out next. Thanks for having us, Poundland.